Hi, I'm Rich Bevins. And I'm Casey Evans. Today we're here to introduce you to our new proximity voltage indicator, a non-contact device that displays voltages from 600 volt to 500 kV. Okay, Casey, let's go through the power up sequence. To turn this unit on, uh, we have just a single button interface right here on the front. This is made to be used with a gloved hand. It's uh, quite simple to operate. You just press and hold until you hear the alarm chirp. And after the initial chirp, you release the button. The unit is now going through and testing each of the LEDs that it is working and testing the audible alarm on each of the ranges. At this point, the volume level can be adjusted by rotating this wiper back and forth and exposing more and less of the internal speaker. Uh, all the way open, it is 108 dB, so it's, uh, it's pretty loud. If it's way up high or on a windy day, you kind of would need something like that. All the way shut, it's dampened quite a bit if you're closer to it on a clear day. Very good. Okay, we're powered up. What should we do next? We should go ahead and test to make sure that the unit is functioning properly. Uh, we're going to use our external tester tester device and plug it into the unit. It will inject a signal and basically simulate a high voltage source and cause the unit to display a reading. So when we plug it in, in this particular case, we should see either the 4 and the 15 kV light, somewhere in that range. Uh, so I'll go ahead and power it on here real quick. And as it comes on, it's doing its own internal self-test of all the lights and the horn. When that concludes, I'm just going to plug the jack right into the socket in front of the unit. And we should see a reading when I move the output clip of the tester tester to the input sensor of the unit itself. And what we have is both 4 and 15 kV lights, so we're within tolerance and we know that this thing is reading properly and ready to be used. So I'll just go ahead and turn it off real quick. Very good. You can always use a known voltage source as well. So to attach the unit, you can use your universal pole of appropriate length or a grip ball. Simply attach the universal head to the other head and make sure the unit is on and you're ready to test. Okay, Casey, we got a couple of extra features on this unit. Uh, let's walk the audience through those. Well, basically, to start out, the proximity tester is designed to measure voltage, or indicate voltage, rather, from 600 volts all the way up to 500 kV. And it does this through a series of voltage ranges that we call voltage classes. Now, we tried to pick ranges and classes that are common in the world. So for example, 4 kV, 15 kV, 25 kV, and so forth. Now basically when you see a indication, and let's say the 15 kV light was illuminated, you would know that 15 kV actually translates between 6.6 .6 and 18 kV. So there's kind of a range, range of, of voltage. voltage. And this is phase to phase. Uh, yeah, as with all our indicators, we're always talking about phase to phase equivalent voltage, not, not phase to ground. Right. Uh, we have a chart defining each of the ranges inside the instruction manual we like to refer everyone to so that when you do see a particular light illuminate, you know exactly what range of voltage you're dealing with. And in the case that you see two lights illuminate at the same time, then at that point it's a little bit more um, resolution basically and you can see that you're between those ranges. And again, the chart in the instruction manual will help to uh, clarify that. Right. And when you're using the unit, basically on the low voltage you need to be about approximately six inches away from the conductor. And on higher voltages you're going to be close to 18 inches. We realize that's probably hard to judge from 35 feet, yeah. but you guys are good at this. Let's go over the range to find field. This is kind of a neat feature that we have. Okay, well this is more of an advanced feature and basically what it's designed to do is allow the user to input how much resolution you would like to see, especially on the low end. 
For example, if you're in a substation, transmission voltage 345 volts. When you turn this thing on, it's real sensitive and you're probably going to see some of the lower end lights and horn come on just from being around that substation. Uh, again, because it measures from proximity, it's not a contact device. So what it allows you to do is, if desired, the user can press and hold the power button, uh, wait and continue holding it past the initial beep, and the lights will start to ascend and illuminate. Now when the target range is reached, go ahead and let off on the power button, and what it'll do is it'll display information at that level and above. It will not display information that level and below, with the exception of our sense light right on the bottom. The sense light will still illuminate solid when it does sense voltage, so it will still show you there's something there, but the horns and lights won't come on until that user preset value is reached, and we can do that real quick. So I'm holding it in. There's the initial beep I'm continuing to hold, and if I wait till it climbs to 25 kV and let out, it will now only give me 25 kV and above, and it will not be beeping at me the entire time I'm, uh, I'm working with it. But the sense light will go from blinking to solid if it does sense voltage. Right. All right, let's wrap this up. What else we got for the audience? Uh, I'd like to remind folks that if you have a question outside the scope of anything seen today in this video, to please refer to the user manual of the product. It is included with the box. We ship one out with each tool. It is also available online. Also, warranty information. This unit carries our standard one-year end-to-end warranty that protects against manufacturer's defects. So uh, should there be an issue, you've got a year as with all the rest of our products. Very good. Well, that wraps up the PSC 403-3737 Proximity Voltage Indicator. And with this and our other fine products, you can find at your local Hubble distributor. Thanks for joining us today and have a great day.